Hey Gemini, K Pisces from kpisces.com and I'm here with your November 2015 Love Edition Love Scopes. Let me just tell y'all what I feel about y'all. Got the cards here. So Gemini, let me just tell you right now, okay? Please maintain some dignity. I think you might be trying to beg, either you begging, it's almost like you messed up and then you try to fix it but you realize the man went a little too far so then you're kind of like not making a fool of yourself but making a fool of yourself <laughs> like chill on the apologies or whatever I feel like if you do if you do a standard apology and just you know what I mean you'll get better results than if you go too far okay Try to show a little bit of sensitivity, but don't show too much because I almost feel like you might fall into some desperation when you're trying to either apologize to somebody or you're trying to fix something. I feel like you get a better outcome if you stay cool versus if you beg. All right. Give them some time. You got to give this person space. You know what I mean? To forgive you or whatever the hell going on. Give them the space. Just don't do too much. Let me spray it. Bam. Okay, let me just. Kino Wands. I pulled one, two, three, four, five cards. Hmm. The Sun Reversed. King of Cups. The Hierophant. Ace of Pentacles. And Two of Wands Reversed. So, what I feel, like I said, so let me just break it down for you. Alright, so with the King of Wands here, the King of Wands and the King of Cups, I feel like. With these two, there's a little bit too much emotion going on. A little bit too much forcefulness with the emotion. I'm going to need you to bring that shit back. Scale it back a little bit. Don't plan on going too far with it. Because you're going to overdo it if you go all the way in. Because emotionally you're feeling really strong about this person. And you're trying to maintain your relationship. So what I want to tell you is to keep it trill. But don't keep it. Don't, don't have it. Don't be so eager. You know what I mean? To like kiss my ass. If you if you're gonna get something, if somebody's gonna give you something, they're gonna give it to you. Okay? And it shouldn't be all this, please, 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 uh, nah, 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 nah. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Don't ever do that. Don't ever do that. <laughs> but I just I feel like um what else do I feel? What is it? Mm. I don't know what situations it is with kids, but some of y'all better be careful because, oh, okay, let me just try to say this without saying it. If there is an unexpected pregnancy that happens, if you don't want a child, wrap it up. Because I feel like you may not be wanting a child. And this may come up. And it, so if you don't want this person to have a baby with you, if you're a man or if you're a woman and you don't want to do it, don't be so brash about it. I mean, express how you feel, but don't be like, oh, hell no. Okay? Because I kind of feel like what's going to happen is you're going to go overboard with your response to whatever this thing is, and it's going to cause an issue. Okay? It may be misinterpreted. So... I don't know where it came from, but it came, so there it is. Wheel of Fortune. So the Wheel of Fortune here, I feel like this Wheel of Fortune is, you know, like I said, keep it trill, but don't make the wrong decision by running off at the mouth because that's going to cause you great issues. The star is here too. Now, I did get the sun reversed, didn't I? Yeah, well, the sun is here reversed, so I mean... It looks good. This could also be unwanted pregnancy, like I said. Because with the the, with the Wheel of Fortune here, the full reverse, the sun reverse, and the star, I feel like it may be an unwanted pregnancy. Something that is welcomed usually. Well, not usually, but it could be something that's welcome, but not so. Maybe you'll feel better about it later if you end up having this child. I don't know why pregnancy coming up. For those of you who can't have children or are not having children, let me just look at it for you. 
Okay, so this is without the kid. So without the without the child or pregnancy or whatever, if you fuck up, don't go in head first. Like I said, step really tread lightly, okay, into your apology. Don't jump and bleh, you know, or start pointing fingers. You did this, you did that. Remember when you did this to me? Or you remember that? Don't do that. Because I feel like you'll regret that later if you jump in with smart mouth. I think you regret it later. I feel like if, you know, if you're a Gemini, if you're giving an apology, that's all well and good. Just be smooth with it. You know, you're Gemini, so be smooth with it if you really want this person to listen to you. If you want to hear you out, come to them. Come to them correct. So I'm really sorry. You know, I went about that all wrong. Don't be like, well, I mean, you know... <laughs> I'm sorry, but don't do that because that's going to get you in a world of trouble. Just I am. So, Gemini. Okay, with the Five of Swords here reverse, apology. I'm just trying to tell you. Okay, yeah, the chariot reverse, you won't get anywhere if you start shits tower. This could be your ass getting caught in something, but like I said, don't cause a shakeup by being mean. If, it's, if something happens, just keep it keep it even. Don't don't start snapping on nobody, okay? I don't know where I don't know where this is coming from. This will be a love reading. <laughs> anyway, it's like I'm joking, but for real, for real. It is a love and relationship reading because we're talking about people, so her Gemini. Kate Pisces from kpisces.com. Check me out for a tell all the whole bar reading. No lies, no lies, no lies. You won't get no lies out of me. I'm sorry. I mean, you know. You want lies looking in the mirror because I ain't got nothing.